So good morning and welcome back. Good back morning. to our normal digging schedule. We've been on our gallivanting and we're back now, back to the fields. And what have we got today, Lucy? Yeah, we've got a brand new field we've never been in before and Just we're so excited about it. It's one we've had our eye for a long time. It's got a right ancient route running all the way through it. So we're hoping there's going to be some stuff come up. It's exciting to be back digging, but to have a new field is just like mega. Excitement on all levels. That's <laughs> what we can find. Yeah, let's get into it. Let's do it. I mean, we might have had a couple of weeks off digging, but we have been super busy, haven't we, Lucy? Yeah, we've been tracking down a new permission. We have, and we've absolutely nailed this down. So we've got this massive pasture field and a little pocket of land that we're going to be exploring over the next couple of weeks, I think. Yeah, I'm really excited about it. So we've got a little bit of plough as well. But today we're focusing on this pasture field, which is massive. Absolutely huge. It's daunting. We've got no idea where the hotspots are. We know nothing about this area. It's neighbouring to our current permission. So we know like some general stuff about the area, but we know nothing about this this side, do we? Yeah, we sort of know there's Roman activity, Celtic, Saxon. Saxon. It's looking promising. Incredibly promising, and I couldn't be more excited to see what's gonna come up. Hi twenties. First signal, see what it is. Even up to thirty. So yeah, first signal. Let's see if it's trash or treasure. <laughs> there look. Oh. Is. Okay. Okay, coiny. There we go. It looks thick. Look yeah. how thick it is. The gloves coming off. Oh, oh cartwheel penny. Oh my god, is that our first cartwheel penny? It's our first penny? cartwheel penny. Oh my yes. God. I thought it looked thick. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, that's pro. First hole. We've been banging on about those for ages. We oh, have. Yeah. First <gasps> hole. What a find. Oh my god. What numbers was that? Like high 20s, 30s? It was quite jumpy, actually. I actually can't believe that. I'm shocked. Hit 30, but even went down to like 24. Look, there's still a bit of text left around the oh edge. My god. Oh my god. Oh, yes. What a find. <laughs> first hole. Can you believe that? Uh, no, I'm in shock. I'm in shock. What a feel. Yes. Everything on the imprint. First coin in the coins pod, I and that is day. a beast. That's a beast, look how big she is. Wow. Yeah. Fills the whole coin pod, basically. I feel like we might have a coin day today. Oh, I'd love a coin day today. Get the full. <laughs> <laughs> Can't believe the first hole was a cartwheel penny. Like, what a stonker of a coin as well. I mean, what a great way to start off this new permission. I know, do you know why they're so big, Lucy? Uh, so do, I do sort of know, but so with forgeries at the time. Yeah, so they had so many forgeries at the time that the royal men speculated that every coin had to have exactly the same weight of metal in it as its value. So this was like a big thing they brought in. Because copper was so low value in the 1800s, that to make a coin that was worth a penny, yeah. used so much copper that they had these like beasts of coins. And the merchants and traders like hated them. Absolutely despised them because they were like so difficult to use in well, everyday use. We were laughing about like how big a purse did you need to cap to carry all these coins. And imagine how hefty it was if you had a couple of them. Like, that was just the value of a penny. I imagine like, a day's wages I feel in like those. you'd know if you dropped one, because you'd literally, like, it would be like losing a ton. <laughs> you'd be, like, lopsided walking yeah. back. It was crazy. They hated them. They only made them for a few years because it was just, like, such a hated, massive coin. And can you believe they made two pences as well? Even bigger. I guess that's also why we've really wanted to find one, because it's such an interesting little bit of coinage history. It's like a little pocket of history that's fascinating and a top bucket lister. Got like a. It was a 1340, but now it's. Don't know. I'm second guessing this one now. Don't know. It's quite deep. So. Little lead bullet? This little jumpy one is a. Yeah, lead bullet. So, still a decent sized signal, worth digging, I think. Yeah. Some people love finding these. <laughs> We're just not one of those people. <laughs> <laughs> Just taking a few steps and 10, 11. I also think it's trying to, it's trying to snow on us. We do have weather warnings today. Oh, we got them, yeah. <clears throat> what do you think we've got? It's 
snow. Oh. Can't believe we're getting snowed on. Oh! Oh, what is it? Look, it's a little gildy button. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, look at that. Oh. Look at the guild on that. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's actually gorgeous. That's so gorgeous. It's actually such a pretty little find, isn't it? Oh, I'm trying for that look, a little guy. I feel like we're going to have a really interesting day if we don't get snowed under. <laughs> I mean, we, haven't, we haven't gone very far. No, have I we? think just go slow. I think so, yeah. First one for the finds, Tim. First one for the, the artifact in there, look. Look at that little guy. Gorgeous. Beautiful little button. The snow. Where's it snowing? Oh no. Oh, Sunny, get some snow. Snow is coming in there. Isn't it? <laughs> oh, God. Can we go out to start? I thought we were getting, meant to get snow till tonight. I thought we were going to get snow till tomorrow. Oh well, it's not too bad at the moment. That's what we do. <laughs> we keep digging. <laughs> Nine, ten. See what that is. There you go. Oh no. First Deep bit of trash. Foil. Oh, sneaky. That's like the top of a champagne bottle. Small piece of bread. Yeah, a little six, seven. Could be a pellet, but new field worth checking. There's your foil. Ah, is it more of that foil? More of the foil, look. I think it's the same one as before. Definitely the same one as before. The rest of the champagne top. <laughs> Might have a penny here. Just because it's jumping up into the 20s. Quite high tone. So, not a penny. No. A week ago we were finding these on the Thames and now they followed us all the way back home to Lincolnshire. A big copper co nail. Big copper nail which sounds just like a copper penny. Little trickster. Now it started. We weren't predicted snow today. You got a target? Oh, well, we've got another target and we've also got some snow. <laughs> That's quite a good one, that. Yeah, oh. Nice sound. Oh my gosh. Oof. I can't believe it's snowing on us. I know. We'll be crazy coming out today. <laughs> this is so extreme. Why are we doing this? You can hear it. I'm going to get closer. Oh. What is that? Is that like a... Oh, just like a copper fitting book. A little fitting. Like a little furniture fitting. All this nice sounding copper. All this lovely copper in the ground. <laughs> All this snow. Getting pretty snowed on now. <gasps> this is mad. Where's Ellie? It's a... <laughs> it's coming down now! <laughs> <laughs> Love 
Not break in the snow. <laughs> what have we got today, Lucy? On the hands. We've got a little, chi little chicken noodle numbers, haven't we? Uh, yeah. Oh, see what's going on. Steam coming off her. That's what you want. A nice hot lunch. Hot lunch in the cold. Oh, yeah. In the snow. Little noodly number in there. Should we have a look at yours? Oh, it looks good. Yeah. Chicken noodle. Yeah, 15. 16. 16. Seems promising. See what that is. Is it promising being this deep? Mm -hmm. I think so. What is it, Ellie? How deep it is, right? More of that champagne Whoa. topper. How has it got so deep? What? How does it sink so low? Wow. Crazy. So it goes up to 20, 19, 20. Oh, yeah. See what that is. Hopefully a penny. Yeah, Ellie covered in snow. Like a little snowman. <laughs> <laughs> It's that little ball, yeah. I think it's a basketball. There we go. Sure. Little beast of a guy. Oh, right? yeah, that's a nice one. Big one. Huge basketball. Lovely. Nice little bit of Civil War history there. You go and join our little button, button friend in the tin. Yeah. <laughs> Artifact tin. I didn't realise we had sheep friends in this field. I didn't realise we had sheep friends in this field. They've suddenly just decided to come and join us in the snow. Hello, guys. If you're liking our digging adventures, please remember to hit that subscribe button and follow our channel. The sheep slowly getting closer to us. <laughs> Don't know why. Don't know what they want. Yeah, I got a new signal. Hi. 20s and the sheep get in and even closer. <laughs> Why are they watching? What do they want? We've got an audience. We're not here to feed you. Oh, can hear something. It's the sheep watching in the background. I hope the sheep don't have any claims to what we're going to find. <laughs> Yeah, what have we got, Ellie? Oh, big penny. Big penny. Yeah. Nice big penny. Has it got any detail or is it toasted? Uh, it looks quite toasty to me. Can't quite make anything out at the minute. But that's a good find. Woohoo! There's your high 20s. Oh, another one for the coins pod. Yeah, going with that beautiful cartwheel penny we found. Get him in there, look at him. Woohoo! Start filling them up. Just got up, got another signal, That's which cool. is low 20s. Yeah. So, is it coinsable? How far away was the other one? There's your hole. Okay, let's see, see what this one is. Where is it? Oh, is that another coin? There we go. Another, Another little toasted, toasted, toasted penny. penny. I reckon from the same, potentially from the same spell. Not much left on that one either. Little toasty guys. Two little toasted pennies. Yeah, I think it's part of the same thing. I'll put them together. So. Yeah. That's free for the coin pod now. A little bit unusual, we've got a 10, 11, 12 between, like exactly between the two pennies that we've just found. What is it? What's that? Oh, it's a pellet, look, it's a bullet. Oh yeah, a little pellet. It's a little bullet. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Where are we going? We're going up the hill, down the hill, across the hill? Up the hill? Up the hill. A little seven, eight for Ellie to dig. <laughs> well, the snow is getting crazy now. Hello. Hello? Yep. Fourteen, fifteen. See what it is. What have we got, Ellie? A little lead bullet. Look. Oh yeah. Proper chunky one, that one. Chunky little guy. That's cool. Did, did I read somewhere that the the bigger they are, the older they are? Not sure if that's true or not. That could be a <laughs> fake information. Eleven, twelve. See what this is going to be. I think she's there. Please be a Roman. <laughs> oh, what is that? What's that? Uh, another pellet. Another bullet. It looked like yeah. almost green then. I was like, I oh, I thought it was maybe like some kind of cool little medieval stud. But no, just a little squished, little squished bullet. <laughs> little lead bullet there. It's a bit daunting, isn't it? I feel like the longer we walk, the bigger the feel gets. <laughs> and we've got another one. Like, a, this might take us months to cover. Little nine, ten, could be another pellet. Right, do you think that little glint's gonna be a button or silver? You gotta make a guess now, Lucy. Ooh, I don't wanna get hopes up. I'm gonna say button. I know, I'm gonna say button as well, just cause I don't wanna be too hopeful. Oh, oh yeah. They're such tricksters. Nice little four hole one though. So probably oh, what, yeah. 18th, 19th century for the four holes? It's quite a shiny one though, isn't it? The snow's making me incredibly muddy. Second button of the day. Another button? Oh, look, definitely a lot newer than that one. I think. Yeah. That one's more 17th, 18th, I'd say. Another little... 10, 11... We're gonna have another button. Got to dig them though. So in the clod. Is it a good sign it's in the clod sometimes? Yeah. Oh, oh no. no. It's another little lead bullet, look. Yeah. An impacted one. Impacted one. We find a lot of these, don't we? We do. Definitely something we've had a lot of. Is that the sheep track? Sheep track. I'm walking in the sheep track. Very strong, 16, 16, 17, let's see what it is. Is it, is it like a seal or anything? Or uh, bag seal? Yeah, because they can often be bag seals or matrix, make, seal matrix that we need to watch out for. But no, I think that that unfortunately happens to be a big lump of lead. Just a slaggy lump of lead. <laughs> <laughs> Ellie's starting to get covered in mud again. It's a common occurrence, <laughs> especially when the snow's on it. Yeah. You've seen the snow well. Yeah, Ellie's in a bit of a state. 15, 16, 
See what it is? Hello, <laughs> digging. So we're quite high up up here. Yeah, so we've got quite a hole here. There's a little green, green something. See if it'll come out in there. I can't tell how big it is. No, 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 actually. Oh, is that it? Is that it? Was it a buckle? Yeah, it's a buckle oh, there. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> a little buckle hiding there, look. It's a spectacle buckle. A spectacle buckle. So that'll be what? Late Tudor sort of era. That'll be spectacle buckles. They were normally around 15, 1600s. Oh, that's lovely. So that's a, oh. a, that's a decent bit of age for us today. Brilliant artifact. Oh. For the artifact turn. Absolutely. So I feel like this is a great little bit of age to come out of the permission. I think a great sign for us. But like quite an unusual location, like halfway up the hill. Like pretty random for a little Tudor spectacle buckle to come up. But this probably dates to around 1500, 1650 AD. I mean, that's got some really good age to it and it's always so thrilled to find a buckle. Absolutely. And it's quite small as well. So it'll be probably from like a small strap fitting, like maybe like part of a horse or like knee, that sort of thing. I wonder what it's doing up there. Is someone gallivanting on a horse and it just like fell off? Traversing the mountainside. <laughs> with the hillside. Very likely to be a penny. Blew your ears off, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Blew my ears off. Just flip the clod. That's what blew your ears off. What is it? It's like a, it's like a lid or something. It's big that. Yeah, massive bit. Massive bit, it's not that. It's quite a beast. Yeah, nine, eight, nine, ten. What have we got in here? Yeah. That looks a bit promising to me. A bit of green. A bit of green. Let's see a bit of green. Bigger than I thought it was going to be. Oh, yeah. What's that then? Uh... Not much. Not much. Not much. Curious, looks like there's a bit of an iron stuck for a copper thing. Interesting. Mm. Yeah, fourteen, fifteen. Oh, look, it's gilted on the back, look. Oh, oh wow. wow. Gorgeous. <sighs> look, and there's even a little bit of original textile on there. Oh, is there? That oh, dark yeah. stuff, yeah. Gorgeous. Do you think the whole button would have been gilted back in the day? Could have been. Probably a little it's nice... It's funny how they wear it on the... It is, isn't it? Nice little 19th century button there. Well, I'd be finding buttons if they're as pretty as that. Kim, so cute. Artifact in building up quite nicely there. Yeah. Lovely little buckle. There, yeah, what's that? Ooh. Is that a button? Oh, is it a little shiny buster? Yeah, look. Button day. This is definitely a button day. Definitely a button oh, it's day. missing the shank. Yeah, missing the shank on that one. A little tomback butter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm running away from you. Yeah, quite consistent 15, 16. There. Yeah. 
Another little bullet, look. Another bullet. Another Heaps in here. There's a huge lead one, that one. Yeah. Quite lovely, those ones, actually. Yeah, I do quite like the bigger ones. A good little aspect. Oh, so I'm like very faint 20s. I think quite deep. We'll have to see what it is. No. Look at all that. So deep down. Massive. Sorry about that, Ellie. <laughs> <laughs> Space will be able to see. Yeah, 15, 16, pretty strong on the footpath. Let's see what it is. Oh, what what is that? Is it green? Oh, yeah. We've got no. ourselves maybe a little, is it a little jet on? Oh, yeah, they could be a jet on, maybe some kind of 16th, 17th century token. It's definitely very thin coppers if it's been hammered, isn't it? Yeah, it I definitely can't... kind of looks a little bit bent. It does, it? like 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 a love S, token. Yeah, is. like yeah. a love token. But I don't see. Um, I mean, I can't see any shank on it. No, so, so I think that could definitely be a token. Yeah, definitely. Maybe a love token. That S is quite suspicious, isn't it? it S is. suspicious. Suspicious S. <laughs> Another one for the coin spot, something to go. fill up. I like an intriguing toasted coin find. They're one of my <laughs> favourites to try an ID. Okay. Not having a bad day here. Oh. No. New Phil's treating us well. Yeah, <laughs> nice there. and muddy. Starting to figure out where to look. Starting to figure it out. The 16, 17, 2D. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sort of another 16, 17, 18. See what that might be. Right there, I think. Oh, there, oh, look. I'll get a bit closer. Let's see what that is. Definitely a bit green in there, that. Yeah. Should. Released it. Is that loose? It's loose. Thank you. Where's it gone? Oh, it's not. No. Where did it go? <laughs> there it is. Is it's it a there. cartridge or a penny? Um, I'd say it's a, it's a penny from. Yeah, look, I'd oh, definitely another say thin one. another thin one that can definitely easily be another another token. It's probably about the right size for a 17th century trade token, I'd say. Or a farthing. Yeah, kind of... not in very good condition, is it? She's been, she's toasty. Someone has for the coin pod, though. Yeah, filling up. Filling up. There we go. Little nine ten, see what that is. Just falling out. There. Yeah, that's a little little bullet. Whoa. Little teeny tiny little bullet. bullet there, look. Another ten eleven. Hopefully it's not another pellet. So it's an Ellie's pen. What was this little ten? Yeah. What's that? Oh, is that another button? Clyde's popper. From a more modern coat, like. Yeah. You know, I, think I, can, so. I can literally ditch the coat that's got it. Yeah. Yeah, if it's a modern little popper. For sure, there. Very strong 16. Yeah. See what that's going to be? Oh, right in the clod. Yeah. Let's get closer for a. Better luck. What is it? Is it lead? Just lead. Oh, I think it's a squashed bullet. Is it? Yeah, I think so. I think 
It's a squash lead bullet, look, because it had the lines. Oh, wow. Very mucky. Very mucky. <laughs> oh, bit of lead, that other one was just solid. So it would have been a crazy one. 31, 32, is it going to be trash or big coin? <laughs> Here's a big coin. Is it? Look. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Get a bit closer. Look at that. Where are you? Here. Just there, look. I kind of think it might be a big coin. Oh, that's so cool. I just think it's another cartwheel. Is it? Imagine it being another cartwheel, never finding any, and then finding two in one day. That'd be incredible. That's like a. It's a double oh cartwheel. God, it is. What double cartwheel. Hell? It's a massive one. That's incredible. It's a huge one. What's that doing up here? Why are they up here? All the way up here. We found a new hot spot. Yeah. Big beast. Second cartwheel penny that we've ever found. That's on the so same awesome. day. Massive brother. Two cartwheel pennies in one day. <laughs> I mean, two bucket lists. Never yeah. Many, many never many found one before. Two. We've literally had two now. One day. What's this? Just walking out. 1920? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Looks interesting. Hmm. Green. Green. It's a good sign. Uh, do they? Some kind of fastening of some copper description. Hmm. Interesting. Not quite the penny we're hoping for. No. <laughs> a great little haul from the first dig. I'm, I'm, I'm chuffed, I'm impressed, I'm happy. I'm happy, conditions were pretty tough. I mean, we did brave the snow, I think that was, that's more than most people did. And double bucket list a day. I know, two cartwheel pennies, which is like, is a first for us. Well, we've been digging for over two years and we've never found one, which I feel like, some people was just like, oh, she's a cartwheel penny. But to us, that was like, You kind door. of, yeah, you want to tick all these different coins off and that's one that we've been after for so long. So long and to find two in one day I feel like was just like peak. I'm really excited to clean those ones up and see if there's like any nice details on them. Absolutely, I can already see Britannia on one of them so I think it's going to make a great clean. If you loved this episode then you've got to go and check out our last digging adventure because that was also on some pasture and we had a great day didn't we Lucy? Yeah we were finding loads of medieval artifacts, coins. We had lead, we had silver, we had it all so you've got to go check it out. If you're feeling inspired and want to get out digging, then we've got a 10% discount code off at LP Metal Detecting, so treat yourself to some new gear. The link's in the description. <laughs>